I hate filming when it's dark outside because then I feel like my lighting is bad. So, you know, it's like dark outside even though it's not even late, but like, what's good? Oh, not today. Yeah, I'm in my bag, but I made it his too. This wasn't on my list, but if you really want money, go get a boyfriend and make him pay for everything. Like, duh. What up guys, it's Haley. So I have not filmed a video in like a good two months and I also haven't shaved my legs in like a good two weeks. But that's besides the point. I haven't uploaded a video in a good two months. I literally had like no free time in September. If you hear this noise, it's my neighbors. I live in an apartment, it kinda sucks sometimes. Last week I was like really sick and low key on my deathbed. But I'm like better now, but like not that much better. Like I'm still like getting over it. But I was sick. I missed like two days of school. And then like all of a sudden I just was like on YouTube all day because I had nothing else to do but lay in bed and be sick. Anyways, you guys probably didn't care to hear all that, but I felt like it owed you an explanation of why I haven't uploaded in two months. And yeah, for today's video, I'm doing easy ways to make money as a teenager. I feel like this is a good time to upload one of these videos because I know like in the upcoming months, it's going to be the holiday season. Therefore, like teenagers, you're gonna need some money. Okay, now it's raining. That's great. If you're like me, then you can relate that you just love money and you love being in your bag. Anyways, I came up with a list of things you can do to make money, earn money, you know, whatever to get you in your bag. Also, literally everything that's on my list, I have done in the past before. So it's not like I'm unexperienced when it comes to these things. If you enjoy this video and want more videos like this, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below any requests you have for future videos. And if you're new, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below. You should go follow me on my other social medias because you know, when I have a two month break like that, you can always just find me on my other social medias. Anyways, let's just get right on into this video. The first way you can make money is by selling your clothes. This is something that I've actually just recently started doing. There's so many different ways to sell your clothes. If you didn't know, there's apps that you can sell your clothes on. There's like Poshmark, Depop. I think Dote is an app that you can sell clothes on. You can also take your clothes to stores like Plato's Closet. I know you can sell your clothes there. When I was a kid, my parents literally would take my clothes to Once Upon a Child. Then there's also social media. You can literally like make a Facebook account make a private story on Snapchat, make an Instagram just for selling clothes. Literally, that's what I did. I made an Instagram just to sell my clothes and I sell them at school. Literally the first week that I did this, I made like probably like a hundred bucks selling my clothes. This is literally one of the easiest ways to make money is just by selling your clothes. Take pictures for people. So if you have like a nice camera or maybe your parents have like a DSLR camera that they don't use that often, take pictures for people. I have a lot of friends at my school who do this. They're always taking pictures for people. You can start off small and work your way up. People are fiends for good pictures. I literally paid one of my friends to take pictures of me like a few weeks ago. So this is definitely something that you should do if you are into that type of stuff. Babysitting. I babysat over the summer and I made pretty decent money from it. You do have to take into consideration that you are basically in charge of somebody else's kid and you are in charge of a life. If you aren't mature or like responsible, I wouldn't babysit garden work slash yard work. I did this a few summers ago. I watered my great grandma's flowers for her cause she had just got out of back surgery. So obviously she like couldn't like walk around that much. So I watered her plants for her. And then I like, you know, would pick dead flowers off of them. Basically I was a flower mom. And then I did the same thing for my grandma. And yeah, they both paid me some money for doing it. Consider doing garden work. You can mow the lawn or because I do live in Michigan and winter's coming, you know, there's snow. So you can like shovel the snow. Those are more towards people who like to be outside, but like, you know, chores slash work around the house. Now this one is kind of iffy. Some parents make their kids do chores, like no matter what. And if your parents are like that, I feel like another way to approach this, maybe just talk to your parents and be like, hey, I want to make some extra money. If there's anything that you want me to do around the house and you would pay me for it, just let me know. That way you're tell you're letting them know that you kind of want to make money and that you're willing to do something around the house to earn it. Or if you don't do chores as it is, ask your parents if 
ask your parents if they will pay you if you do chores i mean you know collect change um this one might sound stupid but like people always have change literally just like collect change and have like a, a like keep it in a bottle i literally have a old strawberry lemonade almost filled to the top of change so i mean that's always something you can do just like ask people for change like ask your family members for change and let's collect it and then you can go turn it in for cash yeah. collecting soda can i don't know if this is a thing where you live but it's a thing where i live and there's deposits on like soda and pop i hate that word basically when you pay for it you have to pay extra for it but once you're done with it you can turn it in if that makes sense i know they don't do this in all states because i'm from florida and i didn't know what this was until i moved to michigan but um like you can turn in like soda cans or soda bottles and you can get money for it. just like start collecting them go on a walk look for them people litter and then you just collect them and then you can go and turn them in and then you can get like a cash slip and then turn it and make money for it do people's hair and makeup if you are good at hair if you are good at makeup literally people will pay for that stuff advertise it on snapchat like around homecoming time winter formal time um prom time like literally just like anything if people want to look nice like they will if you are good at hair if you are good at makeup just advertise it like put something out there being like hey if you ever want your makeup done or your hair done let me know i'll do it for you for that da -da 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 price you know definitely i would advertise it homecoming season winter formal dance season prom season these are all like really good money making opportunities if you are good at those things people will pay so much money to get their hair or their makeup done but see, I don't have that problem because I'm good at both. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Start doing social media. I mean, this one can't happen overnight, but I mean, if you like are actually into it, in my opinion, there's a lot of other ways to get paid from social media. Like brands will offer to send you free things maybe. Like it really just depends. Be a dog walker, literally offer to walk people's dogs. People are really lazy. And if you are looking for money, just like put a flyer out somewhere and be like, hey, you need a dog walker? hey i need some money come up with a reasonable price advertise it boom walk some dogs i mean that one also comes with picking up but i mean if you already have a dog and you're walking your dog for free then like offer to walk other people's dogs and then like it's like kind of just like a killing two birds in one stone sell things that you diy wide or craft people are suckers for buying crafty things story time so when i was in like the fifth grade duct tape wallets were like the big thing i made duct tape wallets religiously and i sold them religiously i had so much money for a fifth grader i sold it to like my entire class once i started selling it to my entire class i started selling it to my grade then from the grade it went to the school and it just kind of got into like this big thing i literally had business cards i had a name for it i was a business owner at 10 years old i am so serious if you were in the fifth grade with me and you remember that like comment down below please friendship bracelets i know kids in my school sell those um if you like are really good at painting sell your paintings like just like sell things that you're good at um, this one's gonna sound kind of stupid but if you really want to make money go to school and ask people for a dollar let's just say you ask 20 people for a dollar let's say 15 of those people give you a dollar that's 15 dollars now i'm not saying like act like you're homeless but it's definitely something you can do if you really want money really just ask people for a dollar because you want something at school and then just save up all your dollars and then boom you make a bunch of money the last thing on my list is getting a real job obviously i obviously if you clicked on this video you probably didn't come to hear me say get a real job but if you really want money get a real job like Go work at McDonald's, Burger King, Subway, a gas station. Anyways, I hope this gave you some ideas of how you can make some money. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope this was useful and helpful for you in any way. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below any requests you have for future videos down below. If you're new, make sure to hit the subscribe button and go follow my other social medias. Anyways, I hope you're having a great day and bye!